In this video, we're going to see how to use the Braille tool in Maya. So for Braille tool, which is under surfaces, Braille and you have three tools and we're going to see the first tool on Braille. So the rest of the two tools are pretty much the same. It just differ differs by its profiles, number of profiles you can add to that Braille. So let's see how you can use the tool to create surfaces which are complicated to create a normal standardized method. So let's see how we can do that. So for that, we're just going to use some curves. I'm going to use two curves, which are the rail curves, which will be parallel or however you want to. But I'm going to say it is a rail curve. So it's not a profile. So we will create the profile next. So let's create our rail curve. I'm holding shift so you can create it a pretty much straight line. And I want it a little bit like that. Or you can get to the control vertex and move that down. So once that is done, I just want to duplicate this on the other side. So let's center position it. And I don't need the grid for that. So now once this is done, we'll just get to the front side of that. So before that, we just have to create another curve, which is going to be our profile curve. So for that, I'm going to get to the another curve tool and going to create the profile curve so I just want to snap the point of the curve to this curve so I'm gonna hold C and then drag the curve which will snap it so once that is done I'm just going to create a curve which looks like a wave for this example and again I'm gonna hold C and then snap the curve to that point whenever you press C you can see here it is the curve snap or snap the curves so once that is done, you will have a surface like that. So this is our profile curve and these two are the rails. So now we are going to, you know, extrude or use the braille thing operation to create the surface. So for that, we will get to the surface and we don't need to select anything when you get to the surface and braille and click the braille one tool. Once you click that, we'll just close this and you can see that here on the command helpline select the profile curve it says so we can select the profile curve first and it says to select the two rail curves which is one and two now you can see that it created the surface for us using curves alone so this is on nerves which is right here which is a nerve surface so when you get to the modify and convert here you can see nerves to polygons and click check this box and move it here so now you can see that we'll just reset the settings for that and now you can see that it is on a triangle so i'm gonna set this to quads and counts so when you hit apply you can see that we got a quads nice quads and it is a polygon and not a nerves we can like hide this and now you can see that it's pretty much what we wanted when you go to the smooth mode you can see how smooth this is so this is how you can use the braille mode or the braille which is under surfaces so this is one but we can use two and three it just depends upon the number of profile curves for the braille it's number two or i'll just move this out it's just nothing that you'll have two profile curves and for the three plus which is right here you will have three or more profile curves like that so that's what the entire braille tool is about thanks for watching i will meet you in another video like share and subscribe thank you